Hello. Class here. Or groove. In the last part, I pulled so many reinforcements onto myself and things took forever. In this part, we're returning back in time to May 11th in order to raid Felheim. And we're just trying to outsmart Ragna, which doesn't sound very difficult. Okay. Ragna losing to Dread Swords. I'm fine, it didn't even hurt. Dots. Chatter? Because I'm resting. Ragna. Ragna. No need to get up. I must attend to some matters with the Deep Folk. I will be back before sundown. As the regular garrison are away, I trust you'll be able to take care of the fort while I'm gone. I'm in charge? Indeed. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I'm in charge of everything. You're in charge of the fort. Briefly. If anyone tries to get in, I'll pummel them into a paste. Yeah. They'll be liquidized. Is that spelled with an S? Maybe it's just the all caps throwing me off. Dots. An intrusion is highly unlikely. Oh, and Ragna. Don't go fooling about in the gold reserves again. When you disorganize the coins, it upsets the... Exchequer? The person that changes checks into X checks. Okay, it's so cold. No wonder everyone who lives here is dead. Hmm. Not everyone. I read... Are Dad, are we there yet? Almost. Do you two remember the plan? Yes. Hmm. I don't. The plan is for me and Orla to sneak into the treasure room via the northern path. Oi. Well, you distract the main forces in the courtyard, Dad. And then, when we've got the gold, Orla and I will escape out the back in a boat. And you'll be away in a balloon from out here. That's right. Well remembered, lad. Hmm, I'm low on units, and there's a large Felheim troop protecting that barracks. Yeah. Dad, who's that skeleton over there waving at you? Hey. That looks like my old friend, Toki. He might be able to lend a hand. I'd better go and speak to him. Yeah, you better. Ah, it's not Fire Emblem. There's still no talk option in the command list. Chatter, chatter. Hello. Good to see you, Toki. Or I have no idea how to pronounce an accent to do. If it was an umlaut, I'd have some idea what I'm doing. Anyway, I need to ask you for a favor, chatter. You need a favor first? Fine, what can I do for you? Chatter, 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 chatter. So your friend's got himself in trouble and is locked up just south of here. Chatter. Yes, I can deal with that. I'll be back before you know it. Alright. So we gotta defeat the dudes down there. Let's see. Swordsman. Yeah, let's just position ourselves here. Wait, this is a purple! Uh-huh. They've scrambled the forces. Yeah, wait, shoot the spear, man. We can finish off the spearman with the commander and then send the dogs towards the, uh, oh wait. Eh, yeah, we, we can finish off the Swordsman, yeah. No problem. Okay, so... Oh, that's... That dog is Black Forces. Okay. Good to know. <laughs> and then you... Just chill. I'm gonna assume that this villager is not gonna get attacked. Alright, purple turn. Let's hope I can remember what I just decided I was going to do. That's part of why things are difficult in this co-op campaign. You make plans for the future, and then you still have to execute it later. 
it's like not that hard. But there's still effort involved. Alright. Uh, their archer will probably hit our archer. And I'm just gonna pretend I'm fine with that. This guy could ransack that, but then he'd probably get murdered. I think it's just that Archer's probably shooting that. I can go ahead and advance that Spearman. Yep. Uh, that was not the commander. I mixed up who I had selected. Might as well hit that even though we're about to ransack it. Now that we've got our forces around like this, the, uh, dude won't get bopped. Alright, what are we doing here? Probably... Mostly murdering that guy. I don't think I run in with the mage right now. I could heal that archer so that he can shoot a little better on his next turn. It would cost all my money, though. probably attacking that. Maybe I do just go in with the mage. I think he just gets owned by spearmen, though. Wait, did I have anything else to do? No, it's only that mage. And I can't make anything out of that. Also, rogue is the unit name that I keep just referring to very generically because I keep forgetting the name. Ransack from the upper tile. Let's see, our movement is decreased, so it'll take two turns to deliver to there, and that'll give the money to black forces. Finish off that guy. Finish off that guy. Deal a lot of damage with the commander. auto-ending turn, because, uh, I moved all the things. Alright. Huh. I don't know if I'd seen their melee attack animation before. I've definitely noticed the shield before. But I don't think I've really paid close attention to the counter-attack. Right, I can't move that right now. Pow, the crit. Alright. I probably eventually want to reinforce that Spearman, but taking the buildings this turn is going to provide some gold. Deal with that Spearman, deal with that Knight. Um, so you're gonna be able to move there and get the crit. So I think the dog can go in and attack a Swordsman. I could theoretically make a Rogue, but sounds bad. Alright. Yeah, crit for the one-shot. Finish off with commander, build some groove. Probably will use that for a healing groove. I don't seem to ever accomplish much with the flame attack. Hmm. 
thing is that healing groove takes a while to actually get anything done. I don't like either groove that much, but I guess the flexibility is worth something on its own. How? Alright. Uh, let's use the archer. Well... No, let's use the spearman. Oh! Didn't actually have to move next to the skeleton, just had to kill all the enemies around it. Chatter, chatter. Uh, no bother, but you should probably get out of here while the going's good. Chatter. Poof. That's the deal. Er, that's that dealt with. I'll go and let Toki know. Alright, I can't make it there this turn. Unless the... Archer counts? Nah, that's, has to be the commander. All right, meanwhile, up here. Can just finish that guy off. Yeah, why not? All right, next turn, can move that in, put down the healing thing. Dog's the only thing I haven't moved. Don't have the money yet for a uh, marksman or whatever they're called. Okay, moving this in, cooling water, do not ignite my own forces. This will keep us safe. Do you deal the most damage to that out of everyone that can reach it? Oh yeah, you, you can deliver the money. Since it was delivered to Black's hideout, I believe that means it's Black's money. Turn four. Yeah, turns in co-op just take forever. Do I want to be positioned on the bridge? Not really. Hey. Right, those bullies have been dealt with and your friend is a free skeleton. Sh shattering. You see the big Felheim troop by the wall? Let's just say that they're in my way. Chatter. Chatter. Chatter, chatter. Chatter. I assume he's like lying to them about something that will convince them to move out of the way. Lots of chattering. Alright, goodbye. Great work, Toki. Now I can get in there and take control of that barracks. Go get him, Dad. All right. Yeah! I knew I'd be good at this. I'm in charge of the whole fort and nothing's going wrong. Yeah! I'm doing a great job. Yeah, you are. Moving over here, I can actually reinforce next turn. Do I hold my gold for when the barracks is captured? I don't think so. I think one marksman will be good to have, although I always seem to, like, be really bad at using marksmen properly. Uh, nobody else can hit that. Alright, healing happened. Uh, finish knocking that down. That might be enough to attract their attention. I don't know if I want to move in. I thought someone had a red highlight around here, as if they were gonna, like, attack their own door or something. Oh, right, that's the wrong person's turn. Um, I do want you to stay within the healing, but I guess you could move a little closer to the door. Right, you should be getting closer to buildings. A free neutralize would be nice. See, I'm gonna ransack the barracks, so I should have the archer shoot down here. No, it's not worth using my groove on my own. Rogue, that's what that's called. Alright, 
Yes, I do want you to get some healing. Move the archer one tile closer to here, I guess. Put that there. Dog still has a move, but I'd rather it stay where it is. Okay. Commander is fully healed. Just in time to tank some things. Get the dog up there, I guess? No, there's safe squares. Uh, let's see, ransack this though. Got the swordsman pulled over. We can just shoot that next round. It's chattering. There are outlaws in the courtyard? What? What do you mean there are outlaws in the courtyard? I put so many soldiers out there. All right, here comes their commander. Now you've got a little room to work, kids. Find your way and Sneaky does it. I'm gonna smash them. If you need something destroying, Destroy it yourself. Okay. So that will presumably pull this downward, because I don't think this force can really deal with a golem that well. Alright. So I could shoot this. That seems fine enough. You're probably attacking there. Dog probably attacks there. Other mage finishes off. I probably lose the dog in the process. You just move in, don't worry about the last bit of healing. 95 is a pretty good percent. Oh yeah, let's make this attack. It's not the greatest trade, in terms of numbers. But, uh... It's at least decent per gold value. Not that you can really just entirely think of gold value when you're basically a pre-deployed map up there. Still, it's a helpful rule of thumb. Like point values of units in chess. Units? Pieces. It's not like you can buy more pieces for points, but it's still good to know what they're worth. I can stay out of the Spearman's range. If I attack from... Oh, right, this mage can't even reach that one. Hmm. They do have some income over here. I could use the purple mage to heal. Healing like this column doesn't sound terrible. I guess, yeah, that's an enemy, but I'd rather involve this Spearman in the heal than this dog, and that's kind of the option I've got. And I don't actually heal the enemy is kind of an important thing to note. Right. I believe I can only drop off things at a hideout, so this has got to run all the way back to the left. All right. Kind of expected that. That's fine. We've got spearmen around to finish off the dogs. All right. That spearman is dealt with. Everyone abandoning the treasure room. Yeah, you don't do, like, anything when you shoot a building. Oh, I could have just hit with him and then maybe even captured with the archer. I thought commanders had slightly less versus building damage. Alright, what do we build that deals with everything that's approaching?
I mean, it probably mostly our commander handles this. It's mostly swordsmen so far. There is that golem coming. I almost just want to save for a trebuchet. I think that'll make it hard for Ragna's forces to deal with me. Why is there a barracks down there? That's the only unit producing building that Ragna has though. So it may just be there for looks. Oh yeah, I gotta, gotta do things up here too. Do I attack from that angle? I think I attack from below. Okay, so I haven't made anything out of my buildings. What is my income? Can I make a swordsman and still get a... No. I can't even get a trebuchet next round. I can make a swordsman this round, though, and get a trebuchet in two rounds. Of course, this is gonna drop off gold in how many rounds? It's got three move. One, two, three, one, two. Okay. Yeah, that takes a while. I guess I'm capturing this next round, actually. Does that... Uh, I think it was still fine to make a swordsman. I don't think it delays me getting a trebuchet. Where's it pronounced trebuchet? Probably is. Alright, pal. I mean, this is fine up here. Got the commander in prime tanking position. Okay, the spearman actually did go for the commander. Oh wait, no, it was the swordsman that had a choice. And it also went for the commander, excellent. Exactly what I wanted to have happen. Huh, am I actually pulling their attention? It's not exactly what I wanted, but they're not gonna knock down their own gates. Swordsman captures. I can't crit with the archer, I have to move. Didn't roll max damage, but... Even if I don't roll good on damage here, which I did, uh, the counterattack wasn't gonna hurt like at all. Just capture with the archer. Can attack that next round with a crit. You might as well shoot what you can shoot. See, commander can get the kill there, although I might want to set down some healing and just get the kill with the archer. Let's see, archer can move to here. And then I can set up a nice tight formation for the healing. Although, like, the first round of healing is so big. Okay. I guess you might as well just finish this off. Cooling water. This will keep us safe. See the spearman's full on health. Right, move you closer. And that's the turn. Yeah, purple has like nothing. Okay, they're coming this way. can get my trebuchet. Or I could contest the golem with a golem. I guess I'm contesting the first golem with T off. Pew! 
Wait, shoot with the archer first. Attack from this position so that the swordsman can capture. I already used that building this round. I could hit that door. Seems ill-advised, but let's get the archer moved forward a little. Yeah, I'm a little shy about knocking down doors right now. Heal up, get a positioning advantage, then we can talk about door knocking down. I guess I can bop it once, probably. Uh... Okay, the game just lagged a little. It wasn't loading an event. <laughs> okay. I might have briefly panicked. Hmm, moving to there. Interesting. I thought it would run straight at me. Oh, it was avoiding the trebuchet. Huh, I can't actually knock it into the water, but it's not going to be relevant if I put it there. But at the same time, maybe I want to, like, bop the other golem? How much damage does this even do? Uh, I don't know. Low health golems are spooky, because that's their crit condition. I'm going to assume the AI just won't knock down this door ever. Good luck on the landing. Hitting the buildings just in case I send another T off over there fast enough that it actually matters. I think buildings restore 10% per round, so it's uh, very unlikely to matter. Alright. Cripple that archer. Stand in the way so that my marksman doesn't get swordsmaned. Neutralize the building, they might re capture, but that's fine. Uh, wait a minute. Oh, second trebuchet. Excellent. Trebuchets are good. Let's let the enemies get a little farther from the gate before we knock it down, actually. I was thinking I could shoot it and then run in on Purple's turn, but I think they could still too easily run back. Uh, mission is not what I wanted. A rank turns are 18. I don't think I'm getting that, but, you know, let's actually set a checkpoint since I brought up the mission menu. Alright, it's just selecting that building that I can't really do anything with. Alright. We're just gonna arrange our units slightly. We're chilling for one round and then we'll knock it down with, uh, the Black Archer. No, she's got the defensive positioning. <laughs> but uh, it's still commander versus swordsman. <laughs> All right, that golem moving like it's gonna do something. Watch out. Let's, uh, let's see, wait. Yeah, I think it's fine to move back here and attack rather than reinforce. Just move this archer up or just kill this. I am then exposing my archer to golem attack, but uh, if that golem wants to attack right there, it can. Five, okay. So I kind of want my archer to attack from here. So that if the golem wants to hit my archer, it then gets crit by the trebuchets. Uh, 
Uh, let's see, if it wants to attack my commander from that forest, it can also just kind of like go ahead. Let's snipe that with our last round on the marksman. Capture that. We've just got a nice line around where our trebuchet is crit. Get another ranger to replace the one we might be about to lose. Let's see, I probably want my commander to start heading left soon. Let's see. Orla, Orla look, the gold. <laughs> Wow, there's heaps of it. No! What? Where did you come from? What the heck is going on here? Laughter. Surprise. Alright. It is only Ragna. Nothing bad immediately happened. That move had no purpose. This move might have a purpose. Alright, the trebuchets haven't acted, but they're exactly where I want them. Run in, bop the Spearman with first attack. Yeah, this is a bit of a mad dash before the enemy forces come back in. Take a slightly more out of the way position. Oh, that disappeared, okay. So there is an event for knocking down the door, it's just the mildest one. Okay, that hurt, but we're about to start heading for the boat anyway. Okay, that's fine. Ragna not actually taking a relevant position. Or wait, it's it's not a boat over here, it's a blimp. No, we're not using that tee off. Got him. Alright, we didn't actually lose the archer because the golem went for our commander, which we vastly preferred. You need to reload. Also, I think this position is more in line with our enemies. Reinforce, it's pretty cheap because those units aren't very expensive. Don't actually have my spearmen lined up at all with each other. heal, because uh, I think we've got enough stuff over here to not lose. The main question is uh, if we have enough stuff over at the right. Alright, it's just selecting the hideout and I have 17 gold. Alright, as much as I would like to take the one shot here, I think we're obligated to grab the gold. We've got the gold! Give that back or I will end you. Oh no, she's gonna kill us. I'd like to see her try. Don't poke the bear, Orla. Head for the docks. You have a boat coming for you. Off you go. Speak of the devil. Get there as quick as you can. I'll head for the balloon south of our stronghold. It's a hideout. We don't have a stronghold. Get Wolfar and the twins their respective zones or something. Throw down a heal, I think that's more relevant than just attacking. Ransack this, if it serves it as a distraction for the enemy, that's perfect. We're all about distractions. Oh, hey. Ragna, I have returned. Has all been quiet? Come back with that gold or I will rip you to pieces. Dots. Ragna, explain. Lord Valder? Uh, everything is fine. Fine? Our garrison is decimated, our fortress has been raided, and it seems our funds have been stolen out from under us. And you would describe the situation as... fine? Yes? I mean, no. I mean, I'm handling it. Perhaps you will allow me to handle it from here on out? Dots. Yes, Lord Valder. Alright, our income is being cut off but it might take another round. We get 100 more gold for our purple heals. 
Oh, that's kind of bad, that harpy positioning, actually. Okay, and actually, we don't get one more round of gold. I don't know if... A big hammer guy is going to make it to the balloon in time. Uh, I guess I can go down uh, this way. And then this is walkable. I don't need to enter from here. Actually, I think that tile isn't flashing. It needs to be... Well, that doesn't have... Okay, that has... Okay, so it needs to be one of the... Six coastline tiles. Okay, you're not gonna catch me. But I might want a mage. Just in case he won't evacuate until they evacuate over here. Okay, you don't kill that. Pal? Uh, yeah, we just want to chill here. No need to act aggressively. can knock down that. You together almost knock down that. Uh, maybe if I heal first. Okay, it was a damage range, but we hit it. Ah, and I did lose my rogue. By my hand, rise! Ray's dead? That skeleton should not be relevant. Oh no, it captured a building. Okay, we disappear. I've made it to the balloon. Get yourselves on that boat, children. I wonder if the harpies can attack that balloon. It is not black colored, it's neutral colored. I can't command it. So I'm guessing they are not gonna hit it. Just get whatever in there. We've got two skeletons to get through. Let's see. All right, we're just defensively positioned. I mean, they can destroy all of this. It doesn't even matter anymore. Just make another... Well, make a ballista. We'll be varied in our anti-air. Alright. Let's see, if I Scorching Fire here... No, Scorching Fire here? I'm thinking, like, at the start of my next turn, I want to clear path to the boat. So this ensures that if they come up to attack the commander, they won't get the body block as well. I don't think the AI is going to be smart enough. Actually, wait a minute. I have both this route and this route. This is a flashing tile. It's also only three tiles. So, yeah... Plus, we, like, might be able to get in there and kill them. Throwing down a heal, because this is probably my last round where I can. <laughs> Alright, Harpy hitting my building. They're hitting my stuff. The dudes decided not to body block. Possibly because of my fire. Not that I think they could have very well, but... Anyway, let's see if we can pad our stats. Hey, you can't get over to the harpies. Ah, that wasn't a kill. Oh, but I can probably pick it up still. So just don't spend the commander's turn doing anything foolish. Alright. 
Yeah, but we went on purple turn. Just run straight through the fire. It's okay as long as you don't stop. Which is kind of weird, because it looks like it's surrounding the cell and not in the middle of the cell. Like, it's meant to act as a wall that prevents movement in or out. Anyway, haha, we're amazing. Yeah, I think we did alright. You did well, kids. You should be proud of yourselves. Rejoice while you can. Your victory will be short-lived. Everyone's below deck, counting the gold. I've never seen so much in one place in all of my life. I hope it's enough to get Enid back. Me too. Hey, what do you think Enid would make of this boat? She'd be up in that crow's nest before you could say anchors away. Yes, she would. Speaking of the crow's nest, yes? I'll race you up there. I don't know if we're... One, two, three, go! Hey, that's cheating. Ragna chasing out the bandits. Dots. Dot. I'm going to catch them. Dots. I'm going to catch them and I'm going to smoosh them. Dots. Alright. Two turns ahead of schedule, actually. And I doubted I would make it at all. And yet, this still took 41 minutes. These co-op missions are just big. You have a lot to do each round. <sighs> Next one will probably take longer, even if it goes well. Still May the 11th, fleeing the Felheim battlefield, the outlaws need to escape their pursuers. And that'll happen next time, hopefully. I mean, maybe it'll be fleeing the Felheim battlefield, the outlaws get owned by their pursuers. Uh, in which case, uh, I guess we just keep retrying this each episode. I probably can't retry in the same episode with how long things take. Anyway, see ya!